Hi, this is Jason with Dave's Computer Tips with another how-to video for you. This one's on how to create and share an Amazon list. Now, if you're on Amazon, you probably notice that you can add items you're looking at to a wish list or a shopping list. Um, and maybe you have not yet, but I'm going to show you in this video how you can create one of these lists and actually name it whatever you want and how you can share it with friends and family so they know exactly what to get you for your birthday or your Christmas gift. So this is what I'm going to do. So the first thing you want to go up to is Amazon.com. And when you're on Amazon, you want to log into your account, and I'm already logged in on mine. Once you're logged in, you want to go up to the top right and hover over Hello, Your Name. And then we want to go down under Your Account, down to Your Lists. And there is a quick way to get to the next step, which is going to right over here to the left and Create List. But we're going to go this way so I can show you how you can get to the lists. So hit Your Lists. And then once we're in here, we're in our lists. And okay, now you might not see this. If you have not created a list before on Amazon, you might see this screen. Pretty straightforward. You just hit create a list button in the middle. And on this screen, since we already have some lists created, you just go up to the top right and hit create a list. So if you don't have a list, you'll see this one. So hit the middle button. And if you do have a list, go up to the top right and hit create list. And now that we're on the create list window, you're going to have three choices here. You can choose shopping list, wish list, or idea list. Well, we want to click on the wish list. And then if you'll notice right up here, this list is for you. Now, we want to keep it that way on this um, video. But you can do it for someone else, but we're doing it for us. So it's you. And now you want to name your list. Because I don't like the name they chose. So I'm going to make it Batman... Two. Since I already have Batman on there, I'm going to make this Batman 2 list. And then over to the right side, you're going to see the privacy. You have it public, which anybody can find it, with your recipient name, which is my name, Jason Sheffield, or um, make it private. I'm going to make this private because I want to share it with only certain people. So I'm going to make it private. And then we're going to hit the button down here that says Create List. Okay, now we have our Batman 2 list. Now we want to now we want to add items to our wish list so that the people know what to buy us. Um, you can do it this way by hitting the add idea to list, but that just gives you words. So you can type in something and they'll put it on there. But I want to actually pick a physical item off Amazon, so I'm going to pick the brownies over here. That's a great gift, isn't it, getting brownies? So once you're on the item you're looking for, you go to the right side, look under Add to Cart, Buy Now, and sometimes there's a subscription one, but then under that you should see Add to List. Click the little arrow next to it, down arrow, and then this should give you all the lists you have, if you have more than one. And I'm going to pick Batman 2, so I'm going to click on that. And that will bring up this screen saying, One item added to Batman 2 list. Now, you're going to do this on every item you want to add to the list, and this screen will pop up each time you add it. Now, when you're done, you want to see your whole list, you can click View Your List right here, and that will take you right to your list. So now we're on the Batman 2 list. And now if you're not on here, you want to find it, you just go back up to the top, and you go down to your list, and it'll show you all your lists. So now you want to make sure, now we're going to show you how you can share your list with your friends and family. And from that, you want to do, make sure you're on your list, and then you want to go up to the top right here, and you can see Send List to Others. And we're going to click on that. And now the Invite Others to your list. You can have Invite Someone to View Only, or they can view and edit. I don't want them editing my list. I want to just click View Only. And now you get this. Your list privacy will be changed to Shared, which is what we want. So we don't have to worry about that. So you can do it. Copy the link, and then you'll have a link you can um, paste into like a social media a messaging system or something and send it to some, someone or you can click invite by email which will open your email system and um, have a little like they have a sentence on it saying that hey I want to invite you to my list da, 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 da. and that's how you create a list and how you share it with others make sure to go to davescomputertips.com that's where all of our articles are also make sure you subscribe to this channel and tell all your friends about it and thanks for watching